Good evening and welcome to Bob's Kitchen. Tonight we're going to make a really simple summer meal. We're going to do a seared ahi steak with a pear and jicama salad and some lemongrass sorbet. We're going to take a couple of Friday night shortcuts because, you know, we've been working all week, but we want to make a really good meal nonetheless. The whole meal will take about 20 minutes to prepare and it'll be really good and good for you. Let's get started. Of course, you can't start a seared ahi without the right ahi steak. Now, ahi is just yellowfin tuna. You'll hear sushi places call it maguro, but since we're going to sear it, it won't be sushi. But you also find it in stores, particularly Japanese stores, as maguro rather than ahi. So, never salt this like you might be for some other steaks because that'll pull moisture out of it, and we want the reverse. Once we sear this, we want all the moisture to be on the inside, so it's a nice rosy red. All I'm going to do to season this is crack some pepper over it and leave this out at room temperature until we're ready to put it in the pan. To go along with our ahi, we're going to make a really simple jicama pear fruit salad. Now, jicama comes as a gourd, like you'll see in the picture here in the next frame, like this. But, you can go to the, the store and buy the gourd, or you can buy it in sticks, like I bought it. Now, I'm going to cut this into cubes, and then I'm going to cut some pear up into small pieces and mix that together in a bowl with vinaigrette and strawberries. With that delicious fruit salad we just put in the fridge to chill, we're going to make a lemongrass sorbet. Now at specialty stores you can pick this up, or if you have the time you can make it yourself. But what we're going to do today is we're going to take a cup of premium lemon sorbet and mix it with two teaspoons of lemongrass concentrate. Now this paste you can get at any gourmet store, but it's really powerful stuff, so make sure a little goes a long way. So two teaspoons and a cup, mix it together and refreeze it. A great thing to serve with seared ahi is what's called wasabi cream. It's basically sour cream, lemon juice, and wasabi. And well, being the organized camera that I am on a Friday night, while I was making my wasabi cream and talking to the camera, the batteries went dead in my camera. So you missed that take. But basically, I'll post the recipe on my website, and it's sour cream, wasabi, and lemon juice. And you'll pour that over your ahi. So, wasabi cream. So finally, we're off to sear our ahi. And searing ahi is really easy. You just want a really, really hot pan, just a little bit of olive oil in the bottom of the pan so nothing sticks. You want a red hot pan. Then we're going to flash sear each side of the ahi for about three minutes. Okay, so that half of the ahi has been cooking. We're just going to flip this over and sear the other side and see if we get that nice brown color, that nice brown color, and that's all we really need. And it's going to sear really quick on this out of a pan. Then we'll gently touch the sides of the pan to get it all seared, and we'll be ready to plate up and serve. Well, that's another edition of Bob's Kitchen. Here's our easy, simple Friday meal. We've got a seared ahi steak with the wasabi cream, a little lemongrass sorbet, the jicama, pear, and strawberry salad. Great, easy meal. Serve it with a glass of white wine and you're all set. This has been another edition of Bob's Kitchen. Check the recipes out at lowfatmuffin.livejournal.com. Have a great night. What have you done to me? I can't eat, I cannot sleep. Not the same